from all I've read about Howard Hughes, I hope he doesn't expect to meet you in some hotel room. What the hell is she doing here? You said you wanted the girl with, with, with the two M's. Yes, Marilyn Monroe. <gasps> The young girl is a Southern Baptist, the boy is a uh, Methodist, and they come pretty much the same time to uh, Hollywood to be under contract to a rather eccentric uh, billionaire, Howard Hughes. Hi, I'm, I'm Frank. Hi. Oh. I decided when I won a talent contest that maybe I'd give it a go in Hollywood. She comes under the assumption that there is a specific set of rules that young women must abide by within the entertainment industry to be successful. Maybe I'm not the right girl for this. A movie actress should have big bosoms and be sexy. I mean, in this town, aren't those the rules? The rules don't apply to you. Something we didn't plan on has happened. Throughout the course of the story, their, their feelings towards each other and the heat of those feelings drive them to act radically and it uh, wreaks havoc on their lives. Who gave that to you? When you told me the rules don't apply to me, you know, they don't apply to you either. I think this movie's in the tradition of a lot of classic Hollywood films. Warren was around for the very tail end of the golden age of Hollywood. He's very specific. There isn't a detail that he will not spend time really trying to understand and make work. He's also incredibly perceptive about um, people in general, and I think that gives him a great insight into working with actors and also being an actor. Have you heard from people that I'm crazy? <laughs> You're an exception. The, the movie is not a biopic of Howard Hughes. It's really a movie that is involved with what I would call the uh, comical consequences and sometimes sad consequences of American uh, sexual puritanism. You do know why Baptists think sex is bad, don't you? Because it might lead to dancing. It has to do with a, a, a thing called uh, love. The rules don't apply.